Hello students, welcome to the craft for solar uh, system week during space month. And we're going to have two crafts happening here. We have a mogul and a disc that shows you how the earth goes around the sun. And the mogul is the whole solar system. Now, when you're putting the mobile together, you can put it together in any order that you want. But if you want to be correct and put the closest planet to the sun going out to the furthest planet, it goes Mercury, Venus, Earth, Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, <laughs> <laughs> and Neptune, and then the questionable Pluto, which some people say is a planet, and some people say is not. And I can't believe during these days, we're still having a debate on whether it's a planet or not. But it still exists, so Pluto is the furthest away from the sun. So we're gonna start by first coloring our suns and our planets. On your mark, get set, go! Okay, now all the coloring is done. Now don't be thrown, because when we were coloring, we saw some rings around your anus. But it is a fact that in 1977, rings around Uranus was, were discovered. Uh, they, we, they just couldn't see them with the regular telescope. It's like it has to be a super powered telescope, but Uranus does have rings around it. So you have two planets with rings. Now we're gonna put these things together. Go! So the first thing we're gonna do is for the mobiles, we're going to put all of our fishing line on so that it can hang. And for the dial, we're going to put in fasteners through the hole so that it, you can then move it around. Now on the mobile, we have the sun has a fastener and the earth has a fastener to spin, but the moon doesn't have a fastener. And did you know that the moon doesn't rotate around? So when we look at the moon, we always see the same side of the moon. That's why conspiracy theorists think that there's aliens on the dark side of the moon that we never see because it's always facing away from us. Interesting fact. We're taping all of the fishing line. Now you have two uh, blue circles so that once you get all of your fishing line set, 
on the blue circle, you can cover it with the other blue circle so you don't see the mess of tape and stuff. So it's like a pretty mobile. And now the dial is done. So you can see, here's the sun, and you can make the earth go around it using your fastener, like it's in orbit. Ooh, that's a tight fastener. Don't put your fastener too tight or it won't spin. And see, it goes around the sun. And the earth rotates, because we know that the earth rotates. But the moon, the face of the moon, always faces the earth. The same side. It doesn't rotate like the earth does. It just goes around the earth. I think I'm going to make Rhonda go faster. Okay, and now we're finished. Uh, Rhonda's mobile has a little bit of craziness going on because the strings were curly. Maybe those are wormholes in space. Look those up. But here's a suggestion. If your string is curly, just tape a penny. She wants you to turn. Just tape a penny to the back of the planet and it'll pull it down to hang straight. See you next time. May the force be with you.